His Royal Highness the Crown Prince and Prime Minister, Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, chaired the weekly cabinet meeting at Gadebia Palace. The cabinet congratulated His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, the Supreme Commander of the Armed Forces, on the 27th anniversary of the founding of the National Guard. The cabinet noted the efficiency and readiness of the National Guard in performing their national duties. The cabinet then congratulated the graduates of the Crown Prince International Scholarship Programme for the successes they have achieved in their careers in the public and private sectors, noting the continuous development the programme has witnessed over the course of its 25-year history. In anticipation of the upcoming Bahrain Diplomatic Day, observed annually on the 14th of January, the Cabinet noted the achievements made by Bahrain in the diplomatic field, which have strengthened the Kingdom's position globally and its role in enhancing stability in the region and internationally. The Cabinet congratulated Sheikh Dr Mohammed Sabah al Suba al Suba following his appointment as the Prime Minister of Kuwait by the Mayor of Kuwait, His Highness Sheikh Michal al Ahmed al Jaba al Suba, wishing him success in serving Kuwait and its people and contributing to its progress and prosperity. The Cabinet celebrated Bahrain's e passport, winning three gold awards and seven silver awards at the London Design Award, and commended the efforts of the Ministry of Interior and other agencies responsible for the passport project, which demonstrated a modern design and stringent security standards in this regard. The Cabinet encouraged the continuation of the Kingdom's digitalisation programmes to improve services provided by various ministries and government institutions. The Cabinet also expressed its condolences to the government and people of Japan for the victims of last week's earthquakes that struck several regions in the island nation and wish the injured a speedy recovery. The Cabinet then discussed and approved the following memorandums. A memorandum submitted by the Ministerial Committee for Financial and Economic Affairs and Fiscal Balance and the Industrial Investment Guide. A memorandum submitted by the Ministerial Committee for Legal and Legislative Affairs regarding several electronic services provided by the Information and E-Government Authority and the support mechanisms. A memorandum submitted by the Ministerial Committee for Legal and Legislative Affairs on an MOU between the Ministry of Industry and Commerce and the Ministry of Industry and Advanced Technology in the UAE. A memorandum submitted by the Ministerial Committee for Legal and Legislative Affairs and the Government's response to four proposals and two laws submitted by the Council of Representatives. The Cabinet reviewed the following. A memorandum submitted by the Ministerial Committee for Financial and Economic Affairs and Fiscal Balance on the positive economic results achieved during celebrated Bahrain events, in which the Cabinet expressed its thanks and appreciation to all government agencies and sponsors from the private sector for their successful organisational efforts. A memorandum submitted by the Minister of Health regarding the developments of the National Task Force for Communicable and Non-Communicable Diseases and the National Committee to Control Smoking and All Types of Tobacco and Its Products. A memorandum submitted by the Minister of Education on the outcomes achieved following re-engineering the qualifications of validation process.